our beautiful world, uh, we kind of enter into this world thinking, okay, this is a typical suburban life. We have a lovely health, a loving, healthy marriage. We have a successful, beautiful couple. What's going to go wrong? You know, um, the party seems like this perfect collection of eclectic, diverse friends. You know, everyone has something going on. You know, I did like how there was so many mixes of conversation. You know, I thought that that was very interesting direction and how I was able to kind of grasp a little bit of this, a little bit of that, which is really how these, you know, a dinner party or a group outing would, would feel like, um, you know, I wonder if this is satire in some way, you know, I, I kind of was wondering like, okay, where's the, when's the ball going to drop? When, where's the comedy aspect? And I'm like, okay, maybe this whole thing is satire. You know, if you think of like a beautiful life or things like that, it's like, is it really beautiful? Like what is beneath the curtain? So that's kind of the question that I think I had the whole time. And maybe that is what the question that they wanted us to ask. This is about the comedy short, Our Beautiful World. Um, I really liked the opening shot of, you know, through the bedroom door, seeing the couple laying in bed in the morning. Um, the music throughout was really nice. I thought it made the tone of the movie. It was just perfect. Um, it was like a perfect world that these people were living in with no drama, no real arguments. Um, great color scheme, by the way. I really like the set design, the cinematography, but especially at the table during uh, the dinner when they were playing cards and everything. Um, but this just made me think, and I'm not sure if this was the point, but how freaking boring would our lives be if we didn't have any sort of wrench thrown in <laughs> our perfect little ideal world? Um, it was almost like they were robots. So, but it was really neat. Um, it kind of left it up to your own, you know, interpretation at the end, and it just kind of wrapped it up in a perfect little scenario at the end too. And uh, I just thought it was like, okay, this could be very boring life if there was no, you know, any drama or things going on to kind of shake things up. So great job to everyone. I thought the acting was really strong. The script was good. The editing. I really did really love the cinematography, the set design, the costumes and makeup and all of that. All of it was really good. The casting. Um, and editing and everything. So great job, all great camera work. Um, just good job all the way around and good luck to you guys. This film is called Our Beautiful World. This was such an entertaining chill short. A couple has an excellent day together. Everything goes well for them. I love the performances of the whole cast. Everyone is so relaxed and having a great time. I kept waiting for something to go wrong but was pleasantly surprised. This is actually so unusual. So often in life and in film, things don't run so smoothly. The settings were gorgeous. The palm trees sway and the locations of the stylish houses really worked. The light colored wardrobe and bright lighting really added to this happy film. The jazzy soundtrack was also so fitting. Well done. Hi, these are my comments on Our Beautiful World. I thought this was a really intriguing watch. While I didn't really understand the story, I thought the cinematography, the acting, and the concept were really beautifully executed from beginning to end. From the very beginning, with the sunny blue skies, you can tell that this is like an LA, like a quintessential LA story. I think the actors did a great job of like capturing that energy along with um, both the leads and the ensemble. I thought that the scenes are really well choreographed, really great spacing. You could see everybody and everybody had really individual, unique characters that really played well together. A lot of great chemistry. I also enjoyed um, the cinematography, that scene where the two different pairs of couples are talking and they're um, conversing on top of each other from that scene when the when the black woman and um, the white partner are in the kitchen together and uh, they're having conversation and the camera's sort of positioned outside in the hallway. That was really beautiful framing. Everything worked really well together. And like the repetitious of the repetitious nature of the of the narrative was really fun and really inviting, almost like a groundhog's day. Yeah, I thought this was really intriguing. Our Beautiful World is an interesting look at, like, you know, an idealistic couple and their day-to-day, -day and, you know, I think that it every performer does a very good job, um, it's, you know, and I think that um, it's very entertaining, very well made, very well edited and everything like that, and yeah. Our Beautiful World. 
This film has a dreamy quality that tells you right away these people that are that we're watching do everything together. They're living in a, a, a almost perfect life, except for they don't seem to recognize Joe from Alaska and what his uh, worth is as somebody to get to know better as a friend. They just sort of let him drift off at their patio party. Um, funny moment at the patio party where the the friends group does a little jazz group dance number that um, isn't particularly entertaining, but it's funny that they think this is something special. And the comment on yoga, everybody's into yoga. They're doing it, they're talking about it. <laughs> I, I love that. Um, the takeaway for me is that, you know, life without conflict, uh, without story, it's meaningless. Um, they're quite a self-serving couple, and it, that's, I think, what the vision must be of the filmmaker. Thank you. Our Beautiful World is an American dream for some people to have this beautiful relationship and spending a day with their friends to then reflect on this wonderful day that they had. It's a picket white fence scenario. It's interesting because this is a world that I'm so not used to in any kind of stability. Uh, so it sort of makes me feel a little uncomfortable as if this is too good to be true. I found myself sort of waiting for the other shoe to drop and it never did. This short seemed utopian even. Like, where's the conflict? Where's the, where's the drama?